two, three. Oh, three. Oh, oh it's an alien. I knew it. Try <laughs> <laughs> again. Now, Christine, now, Christine let's see what color it is. Oh, a bunch. Oh, Try it it's again. a bunch of them. How did it? It's All a right. shotgun? <laughs> Do it again. Shoot shot more. A ton of them. Shoot, shoot more. Just shoot. Just shoot. No, 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 no. Not every time. Just shoot. No. Welcome back guys to No Redemption Outdoors and here we are for another very special announcement. I'm so thrilled. I've been just holding this in now for a few weeks. Uh, link above to a video I made back when I announced that I'm going to be a grandpa for the first time. And in that video, I alluded to the fact that I would be having a follow-up video for yet another announcement and here we are. Today is the day I get to share the big news. I'm going to be a grandpa times two. Yes, yes. <laughs> I am so thrilled, guys. My middle son, Michael, and his beautiful wife, Christine, are expecting a beautiful little girl who will be joining us on April 24, 2021. As you can see from the intro, at first we thought we were having an alien, but uh, I think somebody screwed up on the paintball, don't you? <laughs> and then, of course, we found out it's actually going to be a beautiful little girl, Elizabeth Ann. And, boy, I'm just tickled. I can't even begin to tell you how much I already love her. And then, you know, we have one on its way already that uh, we're going to be uh, welcoming into the world at the end of February. That's my son Clifford and my uh, daughter-in-law Julie's little girl. Scarlet Jean. Uh, she's going to be coming uh, at in the end of February. So, wow, we're going to be busy for the next six months, right, guys? We're going to be, this is going to be a, uh, kind of a happening place with all these uh, little babies. And, oh, I'm just overwhelmed. And I, I can't begin to tell you, uh, I, I hope I'm going to be a good grandpa. I, I don't, you know, I think about the impact that my grandfather made on me. And, you know, it's been more than 40 years since he passed. And to this day, his imprint is very strong on me. So it's such a responsibility. I, you know, on a serious note, it, it, it's important to me to be the best grandpa that I can. And so some of you guys out there who are already grandpas, tell me, tell me what it's like. I know you've shared with me the joy, but tell me something about how you you meet this you know the sense of responsibility that comes with it i i am i'm immensely interested in um how you guys manage to do that and you know i just want to be able to leave the same kind of positive imp imprint on my grandchildren that my grandfather left on me and and um yeah well anyway enough rambling guys thank you for joining me for this big announcement today Just as a side note, I think it'll be another week or so and I'll be getting my new glasses. And that's why I'm not wearing any right now. I do have them still, but they cause me more trouble than I can begin to express. <laughs> if you guys watch the channel, you know. So, I don't know why that just popped in my head, but you know, as a grandpa, you, know, you expect to have glasses, right? I guess maybe that's it. And sure enough, I'm going to be doing that. So, <laughs> all right, well, onward and upward, right? Enough said. Guys, thank you again. If you like what we're doing, drop down below and subscribe. Hit the smash, I'm sorry, smash the like button for me. I am grateful for all your support. And until we meet again, guys, take care. <laughs> Somali,